Hey up photo pips, welcome back to the channel. This is a quick information video about the X-T3 and its RAW files. Now at the moment they are not compatible with anything that Adobe have got out there and a lot of other software companies. Even the Mac doesn't recognise it. So we're going to have to wait for all these updates to come out. Now here is some sky images in my sky folder which was taken with the X-T2 and as you can see the Mac notices them straight away as Fuji RAW files. Now here we have the X-T3 ones and they're not recognised at all. There's no display thumbnail. So what we need to do is find a way of opening it. Now there's a little thing that you're not going to believe that will open this and it is a Luminar 2018 version 1.3.0 and that is going to open your RAW files for your X-T3. No problem whatsoever. There you go. So let's just show you a little bit of uh, playing about here. Let's stick a bit of a vignette on there. Uh, this is just going to be so weird. I'm not even going to think about it. Let's put a bit of clarity in uh, just to show you that it all works perfect. Um, we're going to wait for a preset to load in and I'm going to stick a preset on there. And then I'm going to open it up in Photoshop and just show you exactly what we can do. I just want to take this colour down a little bit because it's a bit blue. There you go, look at that, that's beautiful. In fact, we'll take it all out. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to leave it at that and now I'm going to open it up in Photoshop. And there you can see Lightroom as well. Not tried it yet in Lightroom because I'm not a massive Lightroom user, but it definitely will open up in Photoshop. And then of course, once it's opened up in your Photoshop, you can then head over to your camera raw files. Look, the, the downside about this is that there is no name of the camera, but all the settings are there, not a problem, and everything works fine. Everything works just perfect. And that is the Fujifilm X-T3 RAW file open and close case. Alright guys, I hope this has helped you out. If you're a Luminar user and you've got an X-T3, this is the way you're going to have to open your files. Just while we're waiting for Photoshop to give us that update. Alright guys, get out and shoot. You know you want to. Cheers.